Melania Trump and Jill Biden are due to meet one another during the heated U.S. presidential debate between Donald Trump and President hopeful Joe Biden tonight. Melania Trump attended the first presidential debate tonight in a rare for her look, a mask. She also wore a simple face mask, a widely recommended health precaution to help prevent the spread of the COVID 19 pandemic, which has killed over 200,000 Americans so far. The two women have been at the same events in the past. Including Trump's 2017 inauguration and the December 2018 funeral for George H.W. Bush, where the Bidens sat a row behind the Trumps. But Tuesday marks the first election meeting for the two women, who have taken different approaches to the campaign trail this year. Biden, who has years of experience as a political spouse, has been an active campaigner for her husband, keeping her own travel schedule, conducting interviews, and making the case for his election. Melania Trump, Who was a political neophyte in the 2016 campaign, made the case for her husband's re election bid at the Republican National Convention in August but hasn't appeared at a campaign event for him since then. Jill Biden will spend Tuesday campaigning in Michigan before heading to Ohio to meet her husband for the debate. Melania Trump will travel with the president from Washington, D.C. aboard Air Force One on Tuesday afternoon. Cleveland, Meanwhile, is preparing to host both couples and the mass of aides, security, and media that will descend on the city for the first presidential debate. The 90 minute debate will into six segments, selected by Fox News' Chris Wallace, who is moderating. Melania Trump is ready for first presidential debate in pinstripe suit and navy pumps. Melania Trump joined her husband, President Donald Trump. Today, as the duo departed the White House and headed to the first presidential debate in Cleveland today, the president will be taking on the Democratic nominee Joe Biden in a debate moderated by Fox News anchor Chris Wallace. As the first couple headed to Andrews Air Force Base, Melania showed off her tailored attire in a black and white pinstripe suit layered over a white button down blouse. As for footwear, the first lady decided on a navy suede take of her most beloved pumps from Manolo Blahnik. When it comes to shoes, Trump is a fan of heeled styles, particularly the brand's BB pumps, named after French mid century style icon Brigitte Bardot, along with the label's Irene style. Similar colorways to Melania's pick retail for $665 at Bergdorf Goodman. For Melania Trump, Her pinstripe look today is just one of many statement outfit combinations in her closet. Her designer filled selection includes pieces from Ralph Lauren and Gucci, as well as bespoke designs from her personal stylist, Hervé Pierre, former creative director for Carolina Herrera. In addition to her blue suede pair, the former model oftentimes favors towering heels like the aforementioned Manolo Blahnik pumps, as well as Christian Louboutin's signature So Kate 5 inch heels. She has also been spotted in flatter styles from Roger Vivier and Dior. In any case, both Mrs. Trump and Dr. Biden have attended the same events together in the past. Both were at Mr. Trump's 2017 inauguration event, as well as the funeral for George H.W. Bush in 2018. Dr. Biden and the First Lady have taken different approaches the election year so far, with the former actively campaigning for Mr. Biden's presidential case. Meanwhile, Melania Trump has been less prominent in her husband Donald Trump's campaign, according to analysts. The First Lady did make a supportive speech for Mr. Trump during the Republican National Convention last month. Otherwise, she has been engaging in projects of her own, including her Be Best campaign, which aims to highlight issues facing America's youth. Trevor Noah gives theory on why Melania Trump has not dumped the president. Trevor Noah gave a blistering theory on why the First Lady has not dumped Donald Trump as the comic mocked the president's finances. The late night host joked that Melania Trump has not left her husband because she does not want to share his reported debt in a divorce settlement. If she divorces him, she gets half of the $400 million in debt, Noah quipped on The Daily Show. The New York Times bombshell report into the president's finances claimed that Mr. Trump holds more than $400 million in debt in loans that are coming due in the next four years.